Good morning. Good morning. Hi, uh, I'm a medical student. Um, how may I address you? Peter. Okay, hi Peter. So I'm just going to have a look at your arms today. Is that okay? Sure. Just to check, yeah? All right. So um, for adequate exposure, can I just, could you pull up your sleeves for me? Yeah, very good. Okay, on, and on the other side too, please. Great. Okay, so we'll start with inspection. So you look at the large muscle groups um, for any wasting. So look for symmetry on both sides. Uh, look in the hands for any guttering. Okay, that's good. All right. Uh, also look for any obvious fasciculations. But if you don't see any, then we would generally tap in the large muscle groups to see if we can elicit it. So tap gently. I'm just going to flick gently on your muscle, yeah? Okay, great. So there are no, no fasciculations. The next step will be to assess for the pronator drift. Okay, so um, Peter, do you mind just holding your hands up like this for me? Yeah, just all the way up here. Okay, good. And then can you close your arm, close your eyes for me? Great. Okay, so this is a, to look for pronator drift. Okay, very good. Okay, so you can open your eyes and put your arms down now. Great. Uh, next thing would be to look for the tone. Okay, so or rather to assess for the tone. So, um, Peter, are there any, is there any pain in your arms? Okay, so I'm just going to check for your tone now. Okay, so I just would like you to relax. I'm just going to move your hand or your arm areas for you. Okay, so just relax for me. Okay, so this is tone at the wrist. Always compare on both sides. Very good. Gonna bend and straighten your arm. Okay, just relax for me. Good. Good. Okay, and at this side now, just relax. Good. Okay, great. So that would be the muscle tone. Uh, next thing would be the reflexes. Okay, so you would check for reflexes at various areas. Okay, so Peter, I'm just gonna put your arms here. Okay, so you just relax there for me. Okay, just out a little bit. Very good. So you hold the tendon tapper about two thirds and one third uh, distance at that point. Okay, so you try you would strike the tendon in order to elicit the reflex. Okay, so I'm going to start with the bicep jerk. Okay, so I'm going to find the bicep tendon. Okay, so just relax, uh, Peter. I'm just going to drop this onto your tendon. It doesn't hurt. Okay. Okay. Very good. Next, we'll do the supinator jerk, so just relax for me. Good. This side. Good. Okay, and then the tricep jerk, just relax for me, okay? I will hold up your arm for you. Very good. Good. Okay, and this side, just relax. Very good. Okay. So those, that is the reflexes. Okay, the next thing we'll move on to would then be to test for power. Okay, so for the shoulder, can you put up your arms like this for me? Okay, so don't let me press down, okay? Just keep it there. Very good. Okay, now can you push down on me? Push down. Very good. Okay. Then at the elbows, okay, so can you keep your arm inside like this for me? Don't let me pull it out, okay? So just keep it there. Very good. Okay, now can you push out against me as hard as you can? Very good. Okay. This side the same. Keep it in. Don't let me pull it out. Very good. And push up for me. Very good. Okay. Okay, now can you put your make a fist with your wrist like this? Okay, I want you to keep it there. Don't let me move it, okay? Very good. Okay, and this side now. Keep it there. Good. Okay, and this side. The fist again, just keep it there. Very good. And this one. Good. Excellent. Okay. Now, can you open up your fingers like this? Okay, so just put up your hand. Yeah, open up your fingers. Oh, sorry, keep them together like this. Okay, don't let me push them down, okay? Very good. Okay, now with this hand, just keep it there. Don't let me push it down. Very good. Okay, and then this hand, just curl your fingers around mine. Very good. Okay, don't let me open them, okay? Very good. Okay, and then this one, don't let me open them. Very good. Okay. Now I want you to put your hand up like this. Can you open up your fingers? Good. Just one hand? Yeah, good. Okay. So keep them open. Don't let me close them, okay? Very good. Okay, and then 
this hand now, just keep them open, don't let me close them. As big as you can, spread them out, very good. Okay, excellent, good. Okay, so that was the power, we're going to move on to testing sensation now. Okay, so Peter, um, this is a cotton uh, ball, so I'm just going to use it to touch your forehead. Okay, so this is, do you feel that? Mm. Okay, so that's normal, okay? I'm now going to touch various points on your arms, uh, and I'd like you to tell me if uh, at any point if you feel that it's not the same on both sides or it's not the same as what you felt on your forehead. Is that okay? Alright, so I'm just going to lift your sleeves up again. Okay, very good. Okay, so can you put your hands down here? Great, okay. So can you feel this? Yep. This one? Yep, so just close your eyes for me. Very good, okay. Where am I touching you? There. Good. Now? Right. Good. Now? There. Good. Now? Right. Good. Now? Right. Good. Now? There. Right. Good. Left. Good. Left. Good. Right. Good. Left. Good. Right. Good. Right. Good. Left. Okay, excellent. Great. Okay, um, you can open your eyes now. Okay, so same thing with the pin with the toothpick, okay? So again, I'm just going to touch your forehead now. This is normal, okay? Alright, so same thing. If it's not normal or not the same, as the forehead are not the same on both sides, you let me know, okay? Alright, so just keep your eyes closed. Left. Okay. Right, the uh, left. Left, okay. And now? Right. Okay, now? Right. Good. Okay, now? Right. Now? Left. Okay. Now? Left. Now? Right. Okay. Now? Left. Okay. Right. Good. Left. Right. Good. Left. Good. Right. Good. Right. Good. Left. Good. Excellent. Okay. So that's the end of the sensory examination. So that completes the upper limb exam.